Hey YouTube, it's iAppleShip. Uh, back with another video to show you how to send your um, send your paper or files or whatever from your iPhone or iPad to your uh, Lexmark printer because a lot of people get the Lexmark printer when they get the college package um, for college and they just got it hooked up to their Mac but maybe if they got Apple, other Apple stuff like I do like an iPhone or an iPad they want to uh, take their notes on that and maybe just send it from that instead of going through all the uh, process and sending it to the email you can send it directly from your iPad to your printer so basically what you need to do is go into Apple Store and download this right here it's called LexPrint and then let's see you take a picture or take photos from whatever so I guess in this case, you would take like a screenshot from your um your notes, and then it goes straight to your photos. So you click like choose from photos. Let's say I want to take a picture. Let's see. That. Then I'll click use. Let's see. Okay, and then you want to click this button. Where's it at? And then you scale it to how you want it to fit. And then you click. Hmm. Interesting. Well, it's not working here, but I'm going to show you how it looks on a, the iPad, actually. Because that's what I use it more for, anyways. Uh. All right, so there it is on my iPad right here, and you see it's opening. And right here on the iPad, it takes you directly to the site. And if you download it for your iPad, they say you might need to download something to your Mac. It's called uh, Lex. It's on the site, and it tells you. But let's see. Right here, it says. S600 series it's connected to it says how I want it print it and then see the print button is lit up so if I wanted that I just click the print button and then it just print this or I could go to content up here and then decide where I want it print from when it comes to that but yeah, it's called LexPrint. You get it, you get it for your iPad, and you can um actually let me go back. But yeah, it's called LexPrint, and you can get it for your iPad. And then um also some people um don't have their uh, LexPrint set wirelessly, so mine wasn't working at first. So what I did is I went to the uh, LexPrint settings on my computer on my Mac, changed it so it's uh able to receive. Uh, other networks and stuff and then it starts to print because your iPad's gonna search for the uh, the printer and then since yours is wireless uh, then it will send it to there and then come straight out but it'll take maybe like 30 seconds or something it does take a little while but it's uh, no big deal and uh, let's see is that it uh, let's see also I can show you what I had to download or is it Lex print listener that's what it is and then you, you just download that from the site and it'll show you the iPad it says it doesn't work you can try these things but yeah I downloaded it I'm not sure if it worked or not to be honest but I just figured it out and it got it to work in later but yeah um that's it for today uh thank you rate comment and subscribe please I'll keep in touch